Howdy friends, welcome back to the channel. We're currently heading into the middle of March 2023 here in Western Kentucky. The temperatures are in the low 40s with a chilly breeze running through the forest. Now a lot of us outdoor enthusiasts start to think about what we've been waiting for all winter, camping season. Just like a lot of you, as the warm weather starts to creep itself in, we can start digging through our old gear and getting things right for camp season and have to upgrade on certain equipment due to wear and tear. This season, after pulling out all the gear and stuff, I realized that I had to break down and buy myself a brand new sleeping bag. Today's video, I'm going to show you and review the new sleeping bag that I picked out to make it through this year's camping season. Introducing the Grizzly 6 pound canvas 10 below sleeping bag by Stansport. Available brand new in the box, 6 pounds. Let's open this thing up and give it a try. Okay, I apologize about the wind blowing through here in the rolling back hills of Western Kentucky. We successfully broke out the one-man Rakai tent that you've seen me in other videos. We're gonna take this new Grizzly sleeping bag, roll it out, set it inside, and see how it feels. First of all, let's go through some of the specs on this new sleeping bag. It is called the Grizzly six pound sleep bag made by Stanport. Oversized 81 inches long by 39 inches wide, rated to 10 degrees below Fahrenheit or also 23.3 degrees below is Celsius. It's insulated, double layer construction, oversized zipper. It is also cotton canvas shell, cotton flannel liner, double layer construction, offset stitch construction, helps prevent cold spots and insulation shift. Ooh, right away you can tell this is a nice heavy duty packed bag. And it has canvas on the outside. Let's go ahead and open this thing up. It looks almost the same inside. Let's get this out and set it up inside the tent. All right, this looks like it's fitting in here perfectly into the one man Rakai. Nice canvas. Oh, that looks comfortable. Go ahead and get our boots off, get in there and see how this feels. Oh, already I can see this is set up nice. It's got a zipper protector on here, stand sport, see that? And it's got a heavy duty zipper on here, oversized to help protect and not get any snags, especially when you're trying to zip this up in a hurry when it's cold. All right, this thing feels nice and warm. It's thick, six pounds. Remember, let's open this up. Got a little strap up there. It's kind of like a, just to keep that whole sleeping bag together when you're sleeping. Let's unzip this, no snags, nice heavy duty. Open it up, it's got that classic flannel double insulation in there. Let me grab a pillow, let's get our boots off, let's get in there and see how warm this thing is. All right, off with the boots. Don't wanna be dragging any dirt in here with our nice new Grizzly sleeping bag. Oh yeah, let's give it a try. Oh yeah. Now remember, we're in the low 40s. That wind chill coming through here. It makes it feel like it's in the low 30s. Ooh, oh, feel that. Oh yes. All right, time to zip it up and see how it feels from there. Oh, let's grab that zipper. Oh yes, bring it up. Ooh, I'm already warm. Oh, this feels good. You wish you were here. All right, so we're up here on the one man Rakai in our 10 below Grizzly sleep bag oh my goodness I'll tell you what I'm starting to get warm right now this thing has just got absolutely the insulation we're looking for Wow Wow, this is very very warm now a lot of you folks out there swear by getting those little mummy bags and stuff like that one thing I don't like about the mummy bags is because it really mummifies you up in a spot where you can't move around. I don't know about y'all, no matter whether I'm camping or not, I like to have at least a little bit of room for my legs to move around and stuff. And if you dress even warmer for your head and stuff, but this thing is solid. It's got a canvas shell to it, the classic flannel and everything. I'm out here 
and the elements and there's really not much insulation inside of this tent in fact I've got the rain fly open and I've got the breeze rolling through here and there ain't one part of my body right now that's cold and the biggest thing I worry about being out in this kind of weather is gonna be my toes my hands well, let's see how it really looks when I'm completely bundled up in this thing oh yeah this is a warm sleeping bag I don't care 10 below oh this is comfortable and I got plenty of room to move around in this thing. I mean, I got the door wide open on this tent right now. The wind's coming through except for my nose. I am toasty. <laughs> oh. Oh. Cozy. Well worth it. I could take a nap right out here. And like I said, the wind chill and everything is it's close to being in the low 30s. A small chance of rain. The humidity is very high, so it's a damp chill. We had rain all night last night, and I am cozy as snug as a bug in a rug. <laughs> yeah. mm. now everybody's got their preferences when it comes to camping. A lot of you like hammock camping and all that other good stuff, but if you just want a one good night rest in a one-man tent, whatever it is, you can't go wrong with a sleep bag. It'll fit a grown man, woman, whatever. And you got plenty of room to move around inside of this thing. Double insulated. I can't wait to go camping. <laughs> bang just like that all wrapped back up in the original canvas bag let's wrap this review up wow that is a great sleep bag it is super warm and insulated rated down 10 below fahrenheit and stuff some of you folks that are in the southern regions and stuff you might not ever feel something like that but if you're up here towards where i'm at in western kentucky or anywhere north of that and stuff like that and maybe you want to get out and do a little bit of camping before the real good weather comes this is the way to go i had the door wide open in that one man tent and the wind howling through here and i never felt cold at all except a little bit of my nose all i'd have to do is a little bit of dressing up something over my head or something and i would be absolutely perfectly warm at any given time you guys have it the review of the grizzly six pound double insulated canvas 10 below sleep bag by stan sport a great product very very warm very durable got the canvas sleeving as well as that classic double insulated flannel inside you can't go wrong especially in the cooler regions such as here in western kentucky the only drawback that I see about this is if you're planning on going on hikes for two, three miles, it could be a little bit lumbersome, seeing that it is six pounds, great for car camping, great for going to the campgrounds, all that other good stuff. Now is the time to start thinking about that old sleeping bag that's wore out that you need to upgrade a great value coming in $129, made by Stan Sport, exclusively from Bass Pro Shop Cabela's.